Hello and welcome to the Southern Perspective. My name is Julius Kizzy, bringing you the latest news from the University of Southern Mississippi. Now, homecoming every year is a celebration of tradition and customs for current students and alumni. But all week at Southern Miss, they are showcasing their Southern Miss spirit. Since 1910, the University of Southern Mississippi is celebrating their past and their future. All during the homecoming week, USM students are able to show the reasons that make Southern Miss unique. There's something about the week that when you're walking on campus you can just like feel the Southern Miss spirit in the air even though you can never like exactly pinpoint what it is but it's a really cool atmosphere that week. Any way that Southern Miss could get involved that is how they do it. A canned food drive donating goods to Edwards Street is one way that several members make their mark. But homecoming week itself we really make a point to do something for the greater Hattiesburg community because it does give so much to us. The cans line the offices of the Student Government Association varying from peas to ravioli. These cans will be donated to charity, but most importantly, show that homecoming is not just about fun, but also service. It's a really cool way that we can celebrate Southern Miss's traditions, and one of those traditions is the creed that we like to live by, and part of the creed is being, you know, servants to our community. So we get to give back a little bit, even though it's just one day, we'll make a difference further on as well. Organizations on campus were put into teams on social media showing what they love about Southern Miss. From the Oak Tree House to The Rock, those on social media took it to the top. Yeah, you're competing against each other, but it's still like you're competing against your friends. So there's always like this friendly competition going on. And you even have things like the day of service and the blood drive where people are competing against each other, but also coming together to donate. Another event on campus is the Fountain Sit, where contestants swim in the fountain in the middle of campus, hoping to find a key for prizes. And it may look easy, but... They're pretty difficult. I mean, there's 10 of us in here that kind of like fogged up the water. And it's hard to see the keys, so we're kind of just like blindly going in there looking for touch. On Saturday morning, Hardy Street is packed, waiting on various floats to come through the Southern Miss community. Even local high schools get into the action. And that night, the football team walks off the field, handling action of their own with a 24-14 win over Marshall. Head coach Jay Hobson is also in the homecoming spirit. To say that our fans are on a 12th man is an understatement. They're, they're a big, they're, they're, our players feed off our fans. So uh, we need that eagle walk and we need those fans. That, that, that really gives us a lift. 106 years later, USM still has the spirit to go to the top. That's all for this recap of the homecoming edition. Thank you for watching Southern Perspective. My name is Julius Kizzy, and I'll see you next week.